Hello students, today we are going to discuss your worksheet number 39, class 9th science. As you know that your chapter force and laws of motion is going on and in this worksheet we will discuss about the first law of motion. So Gyan is asking when we are travelling in a bus, we feel jerk in forward direction when brakes are applied suddenly on the moving bus. So Jigyasa is saying that this is on the basis of first law of motions which was given by Newton's any object remains in state of rest or uniform motion in state line until or unless a force is applied on it this is also known as law of inertia the natural tendency of an object to resist a change in this state of uniform motion or rest is called inertia so this is the definition of the in inertia that any natural tendency of an object to resist change in the state of uniform motion or rest is called inertia. Object is having its own natural tendency. You can see a boy who is skating falls down while striking a stone because this stone doesn't want to be in motion or you can say the weight of the stone is very high which resists the, the changes. You can see a biker is going and hits a wall and he fall down. So in a moving bus everything is in motion but whenever driver apply brakes suddenly the bus gets stopped but the upper part of your body is still in motion for a while so we tend to fall forward thus feel jerk forward direction. Similarly if we are standing in a bus and bus begins to move suddenly we tend to fall backward thus feel jerk in the backward direction. So in case of bus case your lower body part was still in motion and the upper body was along with it when the brakes were applied lower body came to rest but upper was still in rest so you feel the jerk so so many examples are there in the daily life next is what is inertia every object opposes the change in the its state of motion it tends to remain in state of rest or motion so you have to remember that any object in motion wants to remain in motion any object in state of rest want to remain in state of rest and they resist any change to their state Mass of an object is the measure of its inertia. This is very important that any object is having higher mass will be having the higher inertia. You can take simple examples that you can easily kick a football but if a stone of the same size of a football cannot be kicked easily. Heavier object will have larger inertia in comparison to the lighter object due to which we need to apply more force to change their state of motion more the heavier the object will be higher will the force required to change it state. Next is some incidents based on the Newton first law of motion. Leaves may be get detached while shaking the branch of a tree vigorously. You have seen that fruits fall, leaves falls, all those because of the first law of motion because we are just shaking the branch and the leaves are still in rest so they detach. When state of motion of a vehicle change the passenger tends to fall or feel jerk in a backward or a forward direction you can see different while you are riding a bicycle and if you apply a front brake you will fall in front okay and you can see in the second case you are keeping a card and on the card one coin has been kept and if you hit the card the coin will fall in the glass because the force was applied on the card not on the coin likewise all of you have played the carom and when we strike the lowermost uh, <coughs> uh, round goatee of the carom, you will see that the other sole remains same, only the lower one has gone out. Grooves is provided in a saucer for place, replacing the teacups and hitting hammer from back of handle it by carpenter to bring it back. So these are the so many examples, separation of dirt particles from carpet while hitting with a stick. All these can be answered on the basis of Newton first law of motion. Let's see question answers. First define inertia. The natural tendency of an object to resist a change in the state of uniform motion or rest is called inertia. Write first law of motion with example. An object remains in a state of rest or a uniform motion in straight line unless acted upon by unbalanced force. Example leaves may get detached while shaking the branch of a tree vigorously. In which direction the passenger will feel the jerk if the bus start moving suddenly? So if a person standing in a bus falls backward and when bus suddenly starts moving in forward direction this happens because when the bus starts moving forward lower part of the 
persons being to move with the bus but where the upper part of the body tends to remain in rest due to inertia and next is which will have more inertia a car and a bus a bicycle and a motorcycle a cart and a train so as we have discussed the more inertia depends on the mass the object having more mass will be having more inertia so you can see first case car and bus bus is heavier so bus will be having higher inertia bicycle and motorcycle so motorcycle and cart and train train so hope you like this worksheet thanks for watching do subscribe